Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory Saturday night to grab bag tonight. We're gonna take a spin to the Everspace 2 prototype. Ever, Everspace 2 uh, just had a Kickstarter not too long ago. And uh, one of the things you could get, depending on uh, how high a level you backed at, was uh, access to the prototype that they have, uh, that Rockfish Games uh, developers have shown off at various conventions and such. Um, so here we are with the prototype. We're gonna start off brand new. I did spend a couple minutes with it the other night just to make sure it worked, and it does. Um, but this is obviously a very, very super early version of the game, as they're obviously describing on the screen right here. Far from feature complete, all content stuff to change, yada 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 yada. There's bugs and stuff that they've already kind of worked out. So until we get access to an alpha version, much later on, probably sometime early next year, uh, we are graced with this prototype instead. So let's, uh, let's start off brandy new. So what I know about this so far is that, um, why is my gamepad not working? Right, right triggers aren't uh, doing what I, what I think they should be doing here. Hmm, that could be a problem. Uh, <laughs> hold up a sec, we gotta figure out why our uh, pad is not doing a thing here. I don't wanna... Yeah, we're definitely not playing this with keyboard and mouse, that would be dumb and stupid, so we gotta figure out why our pad isn't working. Uh, and also we have to figure out how the fuck to get back to the menu. Alright, you know what, let's just close it out, we'll reopen and we'll see if we can make this work. It was working the other night, so I'm not sure why it's not working now. That'd be real silly. It'd be real silly, I was all excited to play this tonight and then the pad doesn't work, that's... Uh, very extremely dumb. Okay, hopefully that's good. We'll have to check to make sure that it's still capturing. It is, very good. Um, okay, hold up a second. Just pretty plug my gamepad once. Ah, there we go. Okay, so I didn't even need to close it out. That was silly. Oh, I don't want to continue though. Mm. Alright, this is already going off the rails. Uh, so, okay, it's so, okay, okay. Management. Alright, right, right. right, I don't know how to accelerate and shit. My first rodeo. How do I get back to. Uh, how do I get out of the fucking. <laughs> oh, there, there we go. Okay. I wanna... Sorry. How did I get to that menu? <laughs> how did I... Seriously. I forgot how I... Yeah, yeah. I did in-game menu. Things are shooting at me. Come on! I just want to get... Oh, there we go. Okay, double tap. No, back to main menu. Sorry. We just need to restart this entire thing. Because I did have a, a section of it going. So, new game. New game, new game. Boy, how great start. Okay. There we go. There we go. Interceptor, uh, Assault Fighter. I'm, I'm partial to the Assault Fighter, so let's go with that. There we go. Whoops, I accidentally fired a missile. That's alright, though. So, there's a, there's a couple core changes that I've already noticed. Uh, uh, one, the boost doesn't really tap out our energy meter. Um, or at least our boost and our weapons use different energy meters now, which is you know, good and or bad depending on how used to Everspace 1 you are. Um, but that's fine, that's fine. Um, we've got an efficient blaster, a railgun, and a coil gun. Let's go for the railgun. Actually, it's, uh, it's just the efficient blaster. There we go. Oh, wow, dang. Okay, okay. So we already know that Rockfish Games is great at making space look pretty. Because, holy heck, space looks pretty. Oh, well, well, who so else is shooting at me? Okay. Well, let's go take care of some business here. So near as I can tell from the glut of meters on the screen is that the far left blue is our boost energy. The next white one is our weapon energy. The red on the inner right there is our hull. The yellow, I believe, is our plating, which is kind of another hull meter. And then the blue on the far right is our shield energy. <laughs> well, didn't even get a chance to really get in on that one. It's fine. 
we're gonna we're gonna take some time tonight. We're just gonna fly around, fly around, have our our little examination of space, you know. My goodness, it looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. And I'm surprised this is actually running so well. Um, that's not a dig at, at Rockfish Games' ability to develop shit, of course. It's just the very early prototype, so it's not going to be super fully optimized or anything like that. Um, and also, my machine's about almost three years old by now. It's, it's pretty beefy, in my opinion, but it's, it's getting on an age. Plus, this is running on Linux through Wine, so it's not even a, a, a native Linux game here. But it's holding its own rather well. My goodness, we're getting lots of iron, I suppose. That's metal, sure, sure, sure. So one thing I also know is that there's not really any voice acting in the prototype, which is, you know, that makes sense. There's, it's, it's a super early prototype, why would they uh, go through all the trouble of uh, putting in final voice actors or whatever. So it will be kind of, like, quiet besides the music that's bumping around here. Damage glyph, sick. Alright, uh, let's see what this does. Wow, that did. Oops. I, uh, accidentally threw the thing at <laughs> Alright, that was, that was kind of silly, but I guess it did the job. Alright, so we, so we start out at our home base over there. Uh, I don't know if that's gonna, uh, be in the final game. Perhaps, perhaps not. Um, I do know that the kind of inertia-based movement here is a little bit silly. Um, just because it's doing a little bit of things that we don't really expect right now. But that's alright. Okay, so what do we got? Sure. Credits. Worker worker drones. Can I use any of these? Or is this just cargo and shit? Hmm. Okay, so that's probably just you know, loot and crap that we can pick up. Sell later on, whatever. So as far as I understand, the way we uh, the way we start out this prototype is we're pretty beefy. So, whoa, jeez, that was a lot of things just going off all at once. Right as I was explaining how beefy we are, we take some big hits. <laughs> so I don't expect we're gonna die necessarily, but that would be extremely embarrassing if we did. At least gonna hold them. God, annoying asteroids. Okay, we leveled up. I don't know what leveling up really does for us. Oh, here we go. Hit points, damage, critical hit chance, device cooldown, which I'm not gonna be really too worried about, I suppose. A moment. Okay. We did it. We survived. <laughs> we survived, and we're in a cave apparently. Cave on an asteroid. Does that still count? I guess it still counts, huh? So we'll take all of this. A mine launcher? Can we just, just take all of our cargo? Oh, that's right, we got some secondary weapons. So we got missiles and we got mines, right? That's about it. I think the menu navigation is still a bit finicky, but that's alright. Credits. Energy core, which we already have, but we're just gonna take it because maybe we can sell it. And now we've got a drone on our side. By holding down one, really. Oh, right, the other thing that we've kind of noticed is that um, we have another ability to travel more quickly across a given area. Um holding that and kind of enter this cruise drive mode which is really nice like never space one you had to kind of meter out your boost energy a little bit and it's just really nice to have like, just turn this on and go faster to an, another point of interest or whatever uh, so that's really handy super handy so far let's see what we got here four power cell let's take all 
I assume we'll run out of storage space eventually, but at this point, not really a concern. Okay, we got some more enemies up there. We may as well go take care of that. On. I think it does automatically deactivate if we get in range of something serious. Let's do this here. Steal whoever shooting. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Everything's fine. Oh, and then that's our our little friendly drone is helping us out there. That's actually rather useful. Thank you. Yes. Close, huh? There we go. We did it. Get our spoils here. Pulse laser. I think we might want to swap that out. Let's see here. What do we have? A coil gun? We've got an efficient blaster. And we just picked up a pulse laser. So let's compare that to our blaster because I believe that's... Our... No. Do this instead. Get the cargo. Here. Uh, 1550. Oh no, the blaster is actually better than the pulse laser. Alright, so let's slap the coil gun back in there. Oh, there. It's like, what is that little box pointing to? It's pointing to my drone. Okay, very good. Uh, alright. That's fine. Um, not 100% certain how we use the other things down the lower left there. I think those are items and or devices. that out a little bit later. This might be where we blasted our way through earlier. Yeah. Kinda of dead over here. What's this? Oh, no. Just fancy stuff. Just eye candy. My goodness, this is very pretty. This is very, very pretty. Already. I love it. Is there any way to get inside this thing? Okay, so there we used up all of our boost energy, so we gotta let it recharge. Okay. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be anything of note on this dude. But, seeing a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff over here. Damage glitch. Let's get on over there. Let's get on over there. There's some points of interest we need to consider. Supposedly that'll be useful eventually. Scrap metal there. Some other things around here. We'll scrap metal there. Shipwreck over here. Credits and another coil gun, which we don't really need, but we'll sell it, presumably. Okay, so we might have tapped out this area, but we should be able to go to somewhere else. Okay, so here's our overall star map, right? Um, so we've got, I think we, we'll 
can't go to these any locations, obviously. But we can go to here, we can go to here. So let's mark that, presumably, and then we can go like this. Get on out of here, go to a fresh place to spread our particular destruction. So we might not be picking a whole lot of fights. Oh, we've got somebody trying to talk to us here. Um, okay, try to track down where it was that was talking to me. Okay, okay. We've got a bead. So how does that shipwreck planet side? Uh, what shipwreck? you like me to do with you then? <laughs> Presumably, uh, slap you over here. I mean, it's highlighted blue like everything else, so... something. <laughs> Alright, so repair. R and repair all. Okay. 310 buckos. We've got plenty of buckos. Let's just do it. It's fine. Don't really need to refill anything. Okay, he gave me this, right? Cool. We got a, ca a cask of wine. Thanks, buddy. Slightly better than what we got, uh, apparently, maybe? Buckos. Oh, yeah, yeah, we did bring him back here. Good. Alright, then whoever popped in. Oh, and then they popped out again. They must have, uh. They must have got tired of waiting for me to blast them, so they just kind of ducked out. Dang. Oh well. Can have a look see around.
Oh, jeez. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's funny. It's kind of popped around. Right, can I activate this to fight for me? I sure can. There we go. Oh, I am full on. Full up. Nothing I can do. Hmm. What do I have that I can ditch so I can actually pick up something important? Picking it back up, great. <laughs> Alright, fine, whatever. Um, can I do anything? Can I do anything with the shit I've been picking up? Is there... Oh, I think there's a trading outpost somewhere so that we can do. Maybe there's over there. In fact, it might behoove us just to go there right now to unload our shit. mechanic, yada yada yada, leaky pipes, yada yada yada. Okay, looks like I'm gonna be doing it for him, that's right. Uh, no, I don't think we're gonna this. Let's repair it first. Uh, okay, so how do I... Ah, here we go. Sell this garbage. That, sell that. Dark matter we'll hang on to. Put our extra coil gun. Scrap metal, polar, super drones, iron kits, pulse laser, kind of garbo, energy core we already got, power cell, energy core we already got, uh, sell that I suppose. 350 bucks for that, sure, sure. And apparently we were. Oh, that's right, because we had swapped this up. Alright, well, let's just sell it. Um, I don't know that we're going to use any of this, so we may as well just get rid of it. Now we've got lots of weapons. And now we've got lots of space. Alright, and that dude wanted us to repair something. So let's go try to do that. This, perhaps? Yeah. Try to do it without mashing ourselves into the... There we go. Whoa, 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 something else is... ships in this area. Freighters, and fighters. I guess it's a trading outpost, so I'd expect it to be pretty dense. Oh, 
and just drag these around. <laughs> Get out of here, stupid freight container. <laughs> Bunch of freight and then sell it back to him. It's more something, more something else. What's the straight pair more leaks? Pretty much leaks we didn't cause. Like, none of that was our fault. It's not like we were firing weapons in the vicinity of a, a pressurized ship or anything like that. Dude, station, I guess. One point two K for five leaks and three mad caps. Yeah, pay me, you idiot. <laughs> Pay me, fuckface. I just did a lot of work for you. There. Very good, then. Better sensor, huh? Some garbage. We'll probably just drop off our shit before we leave this sector. There's still a whole bunch around here. Though. Stand to pick up then. Turn it some whatever this is, Osnal. Much higher kinetic damage, less uh, energy damage, that's fine though. Pretty low range, much lower range than whatever it is I've got uh, highlighted there. Nice energy core, though. Holy shit! Uh, equip that, please. Oh, uh, not what I just did there. Did I did I take it all or? Okay, here we go. Um, equip. Damn. 107.3% recharge rate. 
1.5 seconds recharge delay. For each enemy stunned by EMP in a 700 meter, 700 meter radius, the energy core will regenerate 800. Oh, shit. Better range, better firepower, better utility, better repair. Cool. Picked up a fancy bit of gear. You know what? Let's rob this freighter. <laughs> I want more shit. Give me more shit. did it mostly. It took a, a big beating for doing that, but we got it. Now where's all of our uh, spoils from the battle? That's it? Just a little scrap metal and some other garbage? Bits. Hmm. Can I use one of those? How do I use those? Seems important to know how to use my repair shit. We'll figure that out later. It's not like we're not really too badly damaged considering what we just did there. Ah, oh, that's why they were able to respond so quickly. There's a couple fighters landed at this place. Alright, well, let's go sell our garbage and they'll still be okay selling stuff to me. That dude, that dude's not happy with me. Well, guess what? I'm gonna take your shit anyways. Or is this the dude I was engaging before? Yep, okay. <laughs> there. Now he's pretty much dead in the water. He can't do nothing to me. You guys are just finished the job. <laughs> Get a, a boatload of experience for it. Very pretty explosion. Anything else? More container we didn't blow up. We got nothing for it. Oh hey, hey, who else is? Oh okay. yeah. You're, you're smart, huh? Very angry when you attack their stuff, huh? How dare they? Well, 
really, they don't seem very strong. <laughs> okay. I could go engage that freighter, or go sell the shit that we got. Take off, nice. Dingleberry. Got another one here. Alright, alright, wow, jeez. Okay. They are tired of me just attacking them for no reason. How dare they? Second one? No, I guess not. Okay. <laughs> we have defended ourselves. They attacked first, by the way. That's not true. We totally attacked first. But alright, let's just get rid of our garbage here and we'll be on our way. And everything for 568 buckos. We got plenty of that. Sell everything else. Worse railgun than we what we have, presumably. Thirty-two, thirty-two. Oh no, it's slightly better. Excuse me. All right, uh, let's get rid of that. Um, wait, what the hell? I'm equip. Or that. Oh, okay, I see. Mission blaster, coil gun, rail gun's good. Sell that. Sell that. Scatter gun, I might want to keep. Dark matter we'll hang on to, nano bits we'll hang on to. Sell that. Alright. Cargo is nice and clean now. Done shooting at me? No. Nope. No more defense. There. Easy pick. <laughs>
Okay. Took kind of a beating there, although it was only our plating that really took the brunt of everything. That's fine. <clears throat> Sell everything that we've got, though. That might come down to the little missiles just for grins. Another freighter over there we could harass. Wow, lots of freighters we could. They're not pissed at me though, are they? No, they're like, nah, he's attacking those other ones, it's fine. Ah, we'll leave them be. They haven't really dropped much of anything for us. Things are starting to go a little squiff. This must be a very graphics intensive area. Oh man. Not quite to PowerPoint percent just yet, but oh boy. It's still pretty, but my goodness, that is not the frame rate we're looking for. <laughs> Woo! Alright, let's have a poke around and then we'll get out of this uh, frame rate killing area. Got what we came for, I think. <laughs> so get on out of there and hope the frame rate recovers. <laughs> there we go. Superior coil gun, huh? I'll fucking equip that. And sell our other ill fit. Oh, we've got a better railgun now. 37, 37 versus 51, 51. Hey, okay, yeah. Equip that for bam. It's 10% increased damage against armor. Nice. Percent of energy damage bypasses the armor. 5% chance to disable the target shield for two seconds with each hit. Nice. Cool. Let's sell our garbage. Okay, so we might have uh, tapped out this area besides the other freighters, which we really don't need to spend the time shooting down. Let's have a poke around, see if there's any other areas that we care to see. <laughs> oh, I see. We've got to do. Pull around and do them all, probably, huh?
another one or are we good? There's another one there. There we go. Alright, now now stand clear. but it was highlighted teal, so it might be important. No, nope, it's just ore, but it's worth a pretty penny. Okay, more of those sitting around? Kind of interesting. that shipwreck we were busting to move on over to before we got distracted. There we go. It's over in the lower FPS land here. Just on the other side of lower FPS land. Beam laser. Processor. Okay, now that's gonna be more helpful, is it? Which is the fission blaster? Oh, I see. Okay. Well, plus 10% experience per kill? Hell yeah. A little bit higher energy consumption, who cares? Nice. Beam laser, we're not going to concern ourselves with. Okay, I suppose we can... Whoa! <laughs> I suppose we can go sell the rest of our garbage and then move on. We got nothing else to do, we may as well just go. Give him some assistance here. Tell me what this is all about. Got some drones, outlaws, outlaws, whatever. Mining station over there. And here, we'll give you money to go do this trivial garbage for us. I'll be like, hell yeah, give me money. Give me money while I fly to these different locations and press a, press a button. Probably, right? Yep, there we go. Okay, a couple areas. Distant areas, too.
hell is shooting at me? Did they? Okay, so we got that one adjusted. We've got looks like two more. Why are they so so spread out? Yeah, go get him. Is rubbish. Well, why'd you pick uh, this sun to study then? How about you just pay me my money? Yeah, what about my money? Hundo? It wasn't that much. Okay. Okay, is there anything else of value in this sector? We just help those scientists for chump change, really. So we'll just sell it. Does appear to be better. At least right. Now. All right. Uh, does appear to be better at not letting me slam my face into an asteroid. So that's that's something.
valuable sensor. It's not better than what I got, but hey, you do you, I suppose. Look in mind and we'll escape from around it. Shit that we should be able to loot. Looks like we have anything just picked up that we can do anything with. Well, slightly better sensor, but less firepower, so new. It's very much worse energy core. Uh, cargo slots plus 10. Yes, please. There we go. Nice. Distracted by those guys. Aha. Here we are. Two. Literally nothing. Uh, something blew up. I don't know what that was. It, this big old hulking wreck, and we can't get nothing good out of it, huh? This can't all be winners. I don't know what that was. Looks cool, though. Ooh, auto cannon. Too bad it ain't any. Too bad it ain't any better than what we got. I mean, it's better 
kinetic damage than a coil gun, maybe, but shitty range. Shitty everything else, really. as much as we could out of it, I suppose. Is that the extent of it? Nope. So we got a old mining station, I guess. Can we sell shit to them? just to uh, sell our garbage. Ah, perfect. Damn. 2100. Something there, something there. Dark matter will hold on to. Wiring kit. Sensor, hold on to that. Hold on to that. Right. Rich, 20,000 bucks. So I get it. So the plating is another extra bit of armor that's way cheaper to repair than hull. Okay. That's good. <laughs> Not that it really matters in this uh, little quickie prototype, considering, but... Oh, hey, we can... Do they have any escorts here that we gotta worry about? Oh, yeah, they got two fighters. Alright, well, you know what? Let's, uh... Let's take care of these fuckers first. Escorts first, and then, and we can start robbing. Dark Matter? Wow, that would have been worth a whole bunch DS1. Not really much of anything else, though. Not really carrying too much of value. Alright, this dude's been taking pot shots at me for a minute. That's enough. That's enough of that, sir. We just destroy the entire thing with a single railgun shot? Amazing. Let's see how many containers they actually dropped. None! <laughs> Oops. Ah, well. to him. I love that. I'm sure that's not going to stay in the actual game, but that's funny. Funny regardless. So what did I just do with that dark matter? I just kind of... Hmm, I guess it doesn't matter. Is that it? Is that all the freighters that were around here? Guess we can go back to that other sector and beat the shit out of them. Let's see. Where was that? 
territory? No, no, it's back to the trading station. still around here though is the real big question. If not, that's fine, but looks like there's a couple. Alright, yeah, let's go let's go clean up. We should consider what we're doing before we do it. Holy crap, they have got a lot of escorts. This might be pretty dangerous if we try to do this. Yeah, look at that. Jesus. Fuckers warping in and out everywhere. Uh, hmm. See, that's one, two, three, four, five, six freighters over there. We've got another three there. Some escorts. A lot of escorts, actually. This would be a death sentence if I tried to do this. It'd be a lot of fun, though. Hmm. Let's try to pick them off one at a time. <laughs> This dude's kind of far out. He's got no escorts to him. This was his mistake, really. And suddenly we've got a lot of enemies. <laughs> try. <laughs> if I try to engage any of these other ones, I think we might have a problem. Well, maybe not. There's only really one escort between these three. Thoroughly under- oh, two escorts. Thoroughly understaffed. That's alright. Let's go make things happen.
that one. stuff actually worth grabbing. Ooh, that one seems pretty good. Now hold on, which one would that be replacing? The blaster? I don't know if I want to replace the blaster. So my blaster is my maybe the coil gun. Cause the blaster is the main one I use to take down uh, shields, but eh, we'll hang on to them both, I suppose. Who's popping in here? Oh, we got some outlaws. Cool. We can maybe get some crossfighting going on while I uh, clean up the pieces here.
that. <laughs> Why didn't that other one slot into the... here? Seems like it'd be the same. Piracy runs here. This is what we have right now. Damn. Yeah, let's take it. Oops! Oh shit, I sold it. Well. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Alright, looks like they've got... Man, these dudes don't even care that I'm wrecking all their freighters. Let's see what we got. Fighter there. Okay, this guy's got two escorts.
three freighters left. and a bunch of freighters, I guess. extras to it, so that's not all about. Thing or is there one more yet? There's one more. One more freighter dares hang around this sector.
they're pissed at me for some reason. <laughs> you know what? That's fine. Now we probably have the gear necessary to take these fuckers down, so I ain't even gonna be mad. That dude is trying to ramp me. damage. Shield protect us from everything. Incredible. They drop me. Mm, slightly better sensor. They scratched my plating by 2%. Well, let's fix that for two buckos. <laughs> there we go. Easy peasy. Alright, I think that's all the. Oh, is there more freighters? Those are good to just pick a fight with the fighters, huh? May as well. Nothing else to do in this sector. Alright, sorry about these guys, but. Uh... You know, you were just kind of floating there lazily. Figured I'd uh, get some excitement to your life you know, before you die. Firepower though, and slightly worse range. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
attacking a freighter that I didn't get to? Hey! Paws off my freighters, dude. That's mine. Oh wait, is that an actual outlaw ship though? I'm a bit overpowered here, but fun just picking them off. They don't learn to stop jumping in. I mean, it's not my fault. It's not my fault at all. Hey, Valiant Cheese, how you doing? Good to see you. <clears throat> how am I finding this build? It's it's okay. It's damn fine for a prototype build. Like, I'll be honest, it's, it's, it's very impressive for what they have already. I like it. <laughs> there is a, a lot more to look at than in, uh, than in Everspace 1, that's certainly true. I don't know if I like all that flashy junk, but it's very pretty. So I will give it that. I don't know if I like the numbers flipping about either. That's a good point. Like, what is it, what do the numbers matter if I can't see a total as well? Like, it's it's information that feels a little bit kind of not useful. But hey, whatever. I'm not sure I like the. Um, the meters in the center of my targeting reticle either, or those little curves at the edge, because I'm used to looking at the corners for them, but that's probably just something I'd have to get used to. Plus they sometimes disappear against bright backgrounds, which I'm sure is a, a UX and accessibility thing that will be resolved in future builds. 
Like, I can't really complain too much about what they got. And if I did, well, why the heck did I give them money to build it? <laughs> but if I'm just going to complain about it, why would I give them money to build it in the first place? Right? But no, it's, it's real good. It's real fun. It's exactly as smooth as I would expect. Which is very smooth. Like, they've nailed the fucking space maneuvers pretty well. Even an ES1 was fucking great. Felt so good. Um, alright, are they done warping in now? Have they learned their lesson? They have not. How dare they. I think I'm done taking pot shots at these dudes. Like, they have not learned their lesson not to tangle with me, but that's their problem, not mine. I like that they give you an extra little boosty boost, though. Do some long distance moves. That's helpful. You don't have to constantly drain your boost and then wait for it to recharge and all that. Ooh, that section's a little rough yet. <laughs> what is this thing doing here? I suppose we shouldn't have just uh, rammed full force into it, whatever it is. Outlaw Destroyer. sensitivity too much, so I'm probably playing one about like a, a big dumb idiot. That's right. Alright, so we should go sell all this stuff, get repairs, and, and do what we need to do here. Because I think we, we might actually be done with this for this evening. There's not a whole lot to uh, to go through, but they gave us like three or four areas to, to play around in, and that's pretty good. That's pretty good for all the shit that I've just sold to him. Oh, hey, what the hell? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is. So I could buy back the other thing I didn't mean to sell before. This one, maybe? Yeah. 
So I don't think they have anything of their own to purchase. Fortunate, what are you gonna do? I suppose we could go back to the first sector for a touch, see if there's anything we haven't poked around there. not the home base sector that I was looking for. Maybe it isn't. I haven't interacted with these guys at all. <laughs> I thought I destroyed everything. Okay. Well, let's clean up a little small mess here. That's fine. Ooh. That's an exploding. Explodey stuff going on here. It's just sitting here, and you got a whole bunch of shit that's highlighted that's exploding. Why wouldn't I? Oops. Ouch. back up. <laughs> that was it? That's how I was gonna pay for that? Was one dude was protecting it? Wow. Incredible. Not. 
sink. <laughs> Float my butt up into that asteroid. No problem. out of the sky. Amazing. Alright, so I didn't intend to actually come to this sector. I wanted to go back to home base and see if there was anything else there. Let's see. Alright. Only 10,000 kilometers away. Hop, skip, and a jump. Necessarily need to do any of that. Pop stuff in storage if I care to do it. There's not really anything else here. So, alright, so we just came from Outlaw Turf. We've already cleaned out the trading station pretty much. Uh, we already did that. And the rest is just inaccessible. Because it's prototype and all that, right? Alright. Spent a fair, fair couple hours giving us a little preview. Here, see if there's any secrety secrets hiding from us. I don't know if I necessarily like the auto leveling they're doing here for me. Kind of throws me off. But that's all right.
much identical with uh, a little bit of extra. Oh, plus 10% experience. That was the other thing. I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> we'll hang on to them both. Just because. Ooh, then we have this one. 10% chance to regenerate 20% of hull hit points with each kill. Damn. That seems pretty good, too. That's a good pop to it. Too bad I destroyed everything already, <laughs> so I can't use it on anything. Clip my own wings there. Let's try it. Oh, close. Bonk! <laughs> I didn't even take down my entire shield. Very good. as space is. It's prettily as they have rendered this space. I think we are reaching the limits of, of what we can explore. So it does a pretty good job of not letting me trigger that super boost when I'm about to ram something, but it doesn't quite save me entirely from myself. are going to call it a night then. Well, that was a nice little jaunt through what is presumably a very small portion <laughs> of whatever Space 2 will eventually become. That was a lot of fun, though. That was a lot of fun. Kudos to Rockfish Games for making a good prototype, making a real good game with Everspace 1, and here's hoping that Everspace 2 
becomes so much more. All right, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CST. We'll be back on Assault Android Cactus for a couple of speed runs. And then Monday night, 7 p.m. CST, we'll be back on Jamestown Plus. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.